Hey guys, Togi TCG, and today I have a special video. I just came back from Nationals in Columbus, and I'm gonna show you all the cool stuff I got. First off, I want to apologize for not having any videos up lately. I got a new job, and my sister's been home, so I haven't had the time where no one's using the internet to be able to upload stuff, but I think I found a time that'll work, and hopefully I'll get those up. I have a ton of videos I've made but haven't uploaded yet. Like I have Blastoise CX box and uh, showing of my complete Pokemon collection. I also shot a video of my Manaphy box, but I think it might have gotten erased from my card. But we'll see. So first off, um, for being in masters, or well, any group basically. So I apologize, I have my um, different camera because my batteries ran out for the other one. So I'm not really used to the focus on this one because it's manual. But it's Chaos Tower, Reverse Hollow, with the championship logo. Alright. And you also get this cool lanyard. It has 11 mythical Pokemon on it. Let's see if I hold it back here Mew, Celebi, Jirachi, Manaphy, Darkrai, Shaman, Arceus, Victini. Hildeo, Genesect, and Meloetta. And then on the other side, it's gold, and it says Pokemon National Championship. So there's that. And you also get the playmat. I think this is not going to fit on camera. Um, oh, yeah. But it's really cool. It's got all 12, or 11, sorry, mythical Pokemon, and it's framed in gold, and it says National Championships 2016. The uh, Masters had 1,105 people. Um, I didn't make it to day two, but I mean, I guess I did okay. Um, I had a lot of really close games. I ran a Zygarde EX Kirby Ink Break deck. There was a lot of uh, Jolteon EX that blocks your basic Pokemon, so kind of hard playing against that. I also saw a lot of water box, but I did manage to uh, win some side event games, and I got tickets, and with the tickets, I got, come on, camera. I lent this camera to my sister. I'm not sure if she switched it to autofocus or manual, but national tech box. The uh, play mat looks just like this, except bigger. And then you open it, and there's two deck dividers, Victini and Arceus. And then I also had, I also got, where is it? pack of Phantom Forces with the tickets I won. And I'll just show you the cards I got there. I mean, I'm just going to fast forward here to the good one. I got Hello for Alligator. Like I said, I, I'll check after this video. I think this might have gotten switched to autofocus. Let me look. Yeah, it's switched to autofocus. I'm going to switch that real quick. Autofocus is nice, but I mean manual, you can change the focus here to work better on closer up. See, here we go, getting sharper there. Here we go, hello for alligator. I don't know why I didn't sleep that one. I should though. And also, playing in the tournament let me find it 
I got a Dollar Tree pack. Um, no surprise, but I didn't get anything good here. Um, I did get a Dollar Tree pack once that had Glaceon EX4, and I was shocked. I mean, that's a good card for just paying one dollar. Let me move these out of the way. Yeah, sorry the background's kind of blurry, but when you're on autofocus, you can kind of only choose if you want zoomed in to be sharp and whatnot. And then the stuff I bought from one of the vendor rooms, there were two vendor rooms. I got a pack of Fossil expansion. And this just has Energy Search, Ekans, Horsey, Kabuto, Mysterious Fossil, Sandslash, Ghastly, Cloyster, Krabby, Geodude, and Aerodactyl is the rare. Not a hollow, but I mean, that's a nice looking card anyways. And then, oops. I got two packs, our first edition Explosive Fighter, Volcanion on the front. I'm so excited for this line. Um, I put both the sets of cards in one of these when I made the trip home. So there's um, 10 cards here. And here, I love this. I think this is promoting the movie. You got Volcanion and Victini there. And then, yeah, that's, that's showing um, the dual type Volcanion that comes in some of them. And then, yep, that's the same thing there. And then on the side, oh wait, yeah. That. But here's the Japanese cards I got. I'm, I'm not reading these because I don't know what everything is in English, like, I don't know what that card is. So that's that. I was hoping to get Volcanion, but I mean, we still got, um, shoot, what's it called in English? Siege or something? Steam Siege? I'm excited for that pack. All right, so that's that, and I also got the Shaman box. Here's the pin that comes with that. Here's the promo. It does aromatherapy, heal 30 damage from each of your Pokemon, and magical leaf. Flip a coin if heads, his attack does 20 more damage, and heal 20 damage from this Pokemon. And then, there's the Generations cards that I got with them. I'm just going to go through really fast. I didn't get anything good, so. I mean, it's pretty much cards I already have. Because so I've gotten every Mythical box so far. And so, yeah. I got Rapid Ashes, both my rares, and both my packs as my rare in both the packs, which, crazy. And then, they, what I'm really excited about is they had Pokemon Center there. And so I went in, it was awesome. Sorry guys, my SD card filled up. You can't really see this well, but I'll post a picture of it in the comments section. And that's the shirt. And then I got this super cute sleeping Mew. It's so adorable. And a Generations Elite Trainer Box, which I will open in the next video. So thanks for watching and stay tuned for the Generations opening. Hey guys, so my battery was running low and I completely forgot to show the singles that I also bought at Nationals. Oh, let's get the, maybe the sleeve isn't letting it do this. 
Let me get that focused real quick. I find that with this camera, auto or manual focus works better. Oh, it's still kind of. I know usually I use my other camera, but I'm out of batteries for it. This card is so shiny, it's just having troubles with it. Yeah, manual is on. Okay, there we go. Well, Rocket Small Trace. Look how cool that is. I went into this little shop and they had like base set hollows and stuff for just like a couple dollars each. It was insane. So I got, well, some of them were a couple dollars, some of them were uh, a little more than that. Nino Queen base set hollow. I didn't get nearly as many as I like as I'd like because I also got some old comics there, so it's funny. She has a tack called Boyfriends and it does more for each uh Nino King you have benched. Interesting. That would be an interesting back. Base set Hello Zapdos. I mean, I should have gotten an Articuno. I don't think they had any Articunos though. Um, first edition Light Togetic. I saw this. And I had to get it because it's my avatar and everything here on Togi TCG. And I was like, oh man, I gotta get this. It's such a beautiful card. And it's first edition. And it's in excellent shape here. So, I mean, I love it. Oh, one second. Something got into the sleeve that was in. And then I get it. Erica's Venusaur. I love Erica and I love Venusaur as you guys probably know from watching my videos. So that's it for the older cards. I did get some uh, $1 hollows of Pokemon I just like playing on the games. I mean, I'll show those to you guys, too. And I picked up a, some $1 hollows for my sister, so I'm not showing those in this video. Meganium. Put there. Chestnut. One of the few break cards that I don't have, so... I almost, I have so many of the breakthrough cards, but funny enough, I've not got any of the Houndooms. Archaeops. I love Archaeops, I beat the uh, Elite Four with just my Archaeops. Lucario, my favorite fighting type here. And Togekiss, I got Togetic. I was like, why not, let's get Togekiss. And uh, I have a Southern Island Togepi. So I mean, now yeah, Togepi, Togetic, and Togekiss Hallows, so. All right, thanks, sorry about the whole mess up there but 
I'll be having that Elite Trainer box up too, so be watching for that. Thanks.